pitch. Ali. Expressing position. Again. Expressing position. Have you heard? Okay, try. Expressing position. Good. Expressing position. Now, I want you to form a very small group of in desk wise to to desk just turn to your neighbor and discuss two ways of expressing possession discuss two ways of expressing possession <laughs> Sit down, stand up, 
Sit down. And then now you are okay. Now we have to leave. So in expressing possession, just uh, as you have discussed, we are using possessive pronouns as well as the use of full genitive. When we say the use of genitive, we are defining gender. We have male or female. Male or female. So for example, in singular, first person is <coughs> first person is I. Is it? Yes. Second person is you. 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 And third person is our. Huh? He is all us. He is all us. So th this is in plural. So when the, uh, a person, <coughs> I, is a male, when I is a male or I is a female, we say it is I. mine. Whether it is a male or it is female. a female. I have a watch. It is mine. mine. I have a watch. It is mine. And none. I have, I have a phone. It is <laughs> not mine. No. Okay. You. If you mention it, then you sit down. Okay? You mention it, you sit down. Okay? Say. Boys in school. Boys in school. Good. Sit down. Waitress dress. Good. Sit down. Charles car. Charles car. Agnes's daughter. Okay, now come with those Charles car. Other things. Other other things. We have many things in singular, in plural. Other things. Rakma. He is very good. Pronouns very good, Adija. You very good, Fatim. Hours good. Irregular verb good. Regular nouns what? Genitive good. Possessive good. Nouns good. Gender very good. What? Actually, the purpose of this session is to uh, improve um, uh, is to improve yourself to the uh, um, uh, managing of the first framework. Yes. So um, I think it's very very important uh, on both of us as we are speaking. In all the steps, uh, we should put the the learner. Uh, the student at the center of our hearts. Yes. So everything we speak here, uh, the focus is on the on this on the on the learner. Yes. Yeah, um, and it's very very important for yourself to realize that uh, this session is really beneficial to you, uh, so that you improve your uh, your skills. Uh, in the uh, management of the uh, first framework. So um, I would like to learn uh, that how much, um, uh, how is your time really? To, because I, I think we will have some 30 minutes. Is it okay with you? Or you need uh, any arrangements maybe? Uh, in this moment, we'll have 30 minutes from now. Oh, okay. So I'm looking for your time. Is it comfortable for you? Yes, it is comfortable. 
Uh, do you have enough time maybe after that? Maybe may, sometimes it may happen, maybe we extend or something else may happen. No. How is your time? It is free. It's free. Yes, oh, good, good. Thank you so much. Inshallah, we are going to make as much as possible to let it up to 30 minutes, inshallah. And uh, if Allah wishes, maybe we can even make less than 30 minutes. Yeah, and uh, before we start then also, uh, I would like to learn your expectations. Uh, what is your expectation from this session uh, as far as it's concerned to the first of all? Expectation, it's good, mashallah. May Allah help you uh, to make sure that you attain uh, that expectation, inshallah. So, um, as regard to the um, facilitation you did in a uh, few minutes ago, um, Alhamdulillah, I was very happy because it was a very fantastic one. It was a very, very wonderful one. Uh, Allahi mashallah, congratulations for a uh, very nice uh, facilitation, really. Yeah. Um, so, if, um, if I can give you an opportunity um, to explain uh, which, part, uh, which part of the domain that you are much competent up to now, Challenge in the, uh, the domain uh, and part of sequencing. What is really the, the challenge? Mm, I think um, when we focus on its principle, the principle of uh, I mean, uh, in, in sequencing. Yes. Yes. Mm, uh, especially in structuring and sequencing, when you want to divide, sometimes uh, I'm making a difficulty in dividing those. The, the work, yes, I think that's the main, <laughs> main concern. Okay. But other principles, for example, repetition without boredom, 
I'm not having it only in dividing in structuring but also in the last linking and summarizing I'm, I have no problem with it only in structuring and sequencing yes. uh, what is difficult what is the difficult part in uh, uh, in structuring uh, how do you do and you find that it is really this is a challenge for example, in, in dividing at after which minute our pupils should be, should be do this and this, and that is the, my main thing in terms of time. Mm, I can see I'm, sometimes I'm losing a lot of time trying to, to divide into smaller pieces that cause when it consumes a lot of time. That's in, uh, in terms of managing the time, that's where I, I fail. Okay. Yes. And what, what do you think is the solution? Mm, solution is, uh, I think as I go on, as the days go, I think I become more familiar. I think I be able to manage time, mm. and mm, uh, uh, another solution, uh, as I think now, is to to divide. Yes, dividing them, putting them into smaller pieces, but not this small, small, smallest, the sm the smallest one. So I'm just reducing the division of the size of the part of the lesson. Yes. Oh, good. Um, maybe just to share, um, <coughs> I think that is also something which I, I saw. Uh, you highlight something important which I also wanted maybe to uh, highlight on the same. Uh, um, so, uh, what is very, very important in the part of uh, structuring, uh, the most important part is the planning. Planning. The planning session uh, before coming to class. Yes. You see, planning. Uh, because planning, we we have uh, we have a very common statement that uh, if you fail to plan, you do what? <laughs> no, you, 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 you plan you, to fail. You plan to fail. All right. Yes. So I think it's very very important for you to. Uh, comprehensively plan uh, that this piece, how many pieces I will do today. For example, you had uh, the uh, possession, uh, what, possession of what? Expressing possession. Expressing po possessions. Possession, yes. And you had some pieces of uh, expression of possessions. possessions yes. So you had like uh, Possession of the first pronoun, uh, second pronoun possession, third pronoun possessions, as well as uh, regarding to genders, uh, as well as regarding to numbers, uh, singular and plurals. You see, so this was very important for you to uh, to plan uh, which part should start, which should come next which should come next and in which forms okay yeah so um, is it uh, is it clear to you yes so inshallah uh, what are you going to do next time i think uh, planning my planning my planning yes okay. designing and planning i think that will be best, uh, the best as we have said for example, by today's lesson there, the division of work would be much easier if I, 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 I planned, if I could find it and invent it. Because the, the work itself is it can be divided into many, many pieces. Yes, I think by designing and planning, I, I, can, yes, I can become more familiar with structuring and so, um, when I ask you about uh, which part of the first from which part of domain, I mean which domain that you are much competent of it, you, uh, Alhamdulillah, yeah, and I'm sure it's quite true that you are competent in all the, uh, the four, 
and you had this exception. Suppose if I give you the time of ranking yourself, uh, let us from one to ten. Uh, how much can you rate yourself in terms of uh, confidence to the first from the Okay, thank you. Because I, at first I, 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 I had a problem on, as I said, on structuring, very specific principle on structuring and sequencing. And so out of 10, I feel like 9.23. Ah, very good. Well. Nine point three. Yes. Very good. Very good. Yeah. Um, can we go through um, at least from one uh, domain to another to learn how you did well in the in the facilitation? Um, can I learn how you did with the, the F domain? if the, uh, um, the learning was going because you were able to move around uh, yes to see uh, the, the session going as well as you trusted the learner it's really good I also saw um, a good step in terms of uh, interacting because I uh, really saw that there was a good interaction between students by themselves yes um, maybe something to add, uh, something to add in terms of uh, uh, the, the reviewing part. Yes, uh, maybe before I add, can I hear from you? In the reviewing itself, I think in, uh, in a principle of readiness increase, I was trying and I 
succeeded by putting them, they, they were ready. If yes. I say present, they were ready to present. So they, they ready to present. them very good instructions, mashallah. Yes, yes. good straight instruction. Yes. So in terms of readiness and grace, there was no problem. As I uh, think there was for my side name. In activity facilitation, I was able to, to, to go on with what they were doing. I facilitate during the activity when they are discussing, when they were presenting, or when they are, it was in terms of reviewing. Yes, and then reviewing activity actively as itself, I think I reviewed. I, review on what we have learned from the first session or the possession, what does it mean by possession, no possession by using genitive as well as by using in a snapshot I want to listen from you in the last domain on the transformation part. Mm, transforming as in fact when I want to transform I just want for example in the principle um, that reflection on reality. Yes the reflection on reality called the reflection of reality. I think they were able to use possessive pronouns. That's why I was giving them, okay, they have, uh, someone make a sentence. It is, this watch is belong to me, it is mine. So they were, this bed belong to Shamim, it is hers. So, so they reflect on their belongingness, who, which things belong to, to whom. So they, at least they have some on reality. They, Yes. Yeah. Okay. Um, Madam, thank you so much, and uh, I'll I'll give you the, the general feedback. Uh, and during this feedback, you can write, you can note down some questions. Uh, if there are some uh, important clarifications you will need, please, you will be most welcome. Uh, so uh, I'll give you the, the general uh, feedback from the presentation, from the facilitation, which I, I observed it quite well. Yes. Yeah, as I said before, that the facilitation was good, mashallah. You tried it very well, and inshallah, as I see, you're going to make a, an, a, a super drooper uh, facilitator. Uh, you. you are going to be an expert of first framework, inshallah. <laughs> Thank you. Yes, these are just very early times you can do this way. Mm. As I see, you are going to be an expert, inshallah. Mm. Yeah. So, uh, some, some very few items to, to note. Uh, one is what we have already dis discussed about the, uh, the day flow, mm. that the sequencing it concerns, we are now looking the learner to be the center of all our discussions, okay? Uh, what is happening, um, uh, what, what you need to improve, inshallah, next time, uh, in terms of planning, is to design, is to design something, is to design a lesson that is going to be like something like a social. It's a social activity. Yes. Something like a game. You have to, to be very creative to design something like a game yeah. that will just come automatically for the learners to discover that, okay, now this game is all about, this game is all about uh, expression of possessions. Yes. So, um, uh, we, we, we need not to uh, give them uh, that today we are going to do on yes. expression of uh, a, a possession. The game itself should give the meaning to the learners. Yes. 
you see the game itself should give a meaning to the learner to understand that okay now this game was all because in the review part we have the what so what now what okay now all these three important steps are going to be very difficult if there was no something discoverable there must be a kind of a game a kind of an a social activity that will trigger that will let you as a facilitator trigger the questions to the answers what happened what was this what was happening what was this what was he doing what was this for them to understand that okay now this was in the second part so what the so what will help them to know the importance of the activity and now now what uh, you will build or uh, structure some questions that will lead them uh, to reflect that uh, now uh, we need to do something. We need to do. It's, 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 it's a kind of an action, okay? So uh, the planning side reflects, as you said, that it is a it's a challenge. So I think you have to work out work out very very clear, uh, so that you can have this review in part clear. Um, you can see in your facilitation, you used a lot of pushing to explain them about the, 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 the first pronoun, the second pronoun, the, the third pronoun, and the observer, the numbers observer. And now it was also uh, difficult for the part of transformation. We need to, uh, in the transformation part, we have the three, the three parts, reflection on reality. And the reflection on reality have got also some three important subsections okay. for the learner to experience and to explain the experience before he came to the session for the learner to explain the experience during the session and then the learner should explain what should be their experience what is he going to do outside the session. This is reflection in reality. And then we have the second part which is practice. Uh, Alhamdulillah there was some practice. They were practicing using the uh, different positions and so So in the, in the last part which is um, a continuity and follow-up, that was now a part to do the action plans. Uh, the action plan. Uh, what are they going to do? Uh, uh, this is the in terms of missions. Uh, are they going to do research? Are they going to to draw for use some of the uh, uh, possession statements? Are they going to do some uh, simulations? Are they going to do something that are, are th that they are really going to? To experience it uh, after the, the session. These are very uh, important parts, inshallah, which uh, I need to, uh, to, to take. Do you have any questions from uh, this feedback? And uh, now I want to learn your actions in the future, in the, in the next facilitation, for example, what are you going to do? First of all, um, designing, designing a lesson, um, oh, uh, it's generally all of that in planning, planning a lesson which will enable me to cover all over the domains, all five domains should be 
include included there. So by so I have to design a game. Yes, a game which will, will, will trigger. When we, we put that game on trigger, what will, will people will good will have no answers. Okay, now today we are going to have this and this because of this this game. So designing a game, a, an educational game, as well as um, I think on in on the issue of um, pushing. That's it to designing more and more so that you uh, it can pull a lot from them. Yes, and I I think I will continue being doing those two major roles of adding learning as well as assessing. Yes. Inshallah, inshallah, mashallah. Uh, thank you so much, and uh, I hope, uh, as I said, you are going to make an excellent. Uh, first from work, uh, expert, uh, you are doing good, mashallah. Uh, if you work out all these steps which I have done, and these are just very early uh, moments we are uh, progressing. So, inshallah, I would like to see you again and again improving. Uh, I'm sure, inshallah, next time you will be very, very different, provided that you are going to work out on the challenges you have uh, drawn for yourself today. Thank you so much, madam. See you next time, inshallah. 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 Assalamu alaikum.